this person is missing you a lot. They're missing you a lot, okay? They feel left out by you, they feel abandoned by you, you don't give a shit to them. You literally like just sideline them is what I'm getting here. Ice them out, you probably even moved on, whatever, right? But you're just not giving them the attention. This person is very codependent, okay? This person could be very codependent on you, okay? For your support, your love. I'm getting this is someone here, you know, who didn't give a shit to you or who was never there to support you all this while. And uh, you were the one who was carrying the entire weight of the relationship. And now that you have put an end to this relationship here, this person instead feels backstabbed and betrayed by you. They feel very hurt and they feel like, oh my God, like this is what you do, right? To the relationship, like you couldn't just take care of the relationship or you just couldn't fall through or you just uh, left them midway and left. But the thing is that they kept leaving, leaving you all this while whilst you were holding on. And probably this is the first time that you have completely let them go and you're, you're just moving on, ice them out, giving them the cold shoulder and now they can't take it. They're going through a lot of stress and exhaustion right now thinking about this connection and missing you is just like next level. They want you to come towards them. They want you to mother them, whatever, take care of them, okay? But they just refuse to do the growing up. I also feel here right now this person is probably trying to distract themselves, okay? By keeping themselves very, very busy, okay? They're trying to see to it that they don't, try, you know, they do miss you, but so that they don't come towards you with that needy energy because I'm getting ego here for some reason. This person is a little bit of in their ego and I think they're trying to avoid coming towards you as much as they can. Yeah, because this person is trying to avoid a decision, okay? This person knows that they're at a crossroads. So you let them go, okay? Probably because this person commi didn't commit to you or they just weren't taking this relationship as seriously as you were, whatever the issue is, okay? But I feel here you ended things with this person here. Now this person is just like, you know what? They're just not being able to accept the ending for sure. This person is trying to distract themselves, okay? Why? Not because they're wanting to, um, you know... Um, work on themselves but i feel this person is trying to uh, distract themselves probably by being a workaholic because they're trying to ignore and making a decision here they know that they made the wrong decision okay by letting you go or by not doing what they were supposed to do but now this person is more like at a crossroads right now okay they're i think trying to understand what went wrong in the relationship and they're trying to work on themselves here but they're still avoiding making a decision about what to do about you or uh, just wanting to come towards you okay because i feel this person fears change or they're just trying to play it safe because they don't know what your reactions will be yeah they want a brand new beginning with you okay but the thing is that they're not taking action. The love is there. They want to apologize to you. But I feel this person here is, again, like I said, right? They're feeling very isolated. This person could have a lot of abandonment issues. You know, the one I'm getting here. You know, you're dealing with someone here who you could have a lot of false starts with, okay? Like things just keep, you know, it's like flame on, flame off, on and off, on and off, on and off connection. This connection lacked a lot of stability, okay? Because of it, you probably could have got fed up by the end of the time and you're like, you know what? I'm done. This is it. Totally fed up and exhausted. I can't do this anymore. So actually, you were the one who felt backstab betrayed. But this person out here is trying to play the victim like, oh my God, this is what Leo did to me. This is what was done to me. All this while I love Leo so much and this is what I get back in return kind of energy. Okay. All right. What are this person? What, was the, what will this person feel for Leo for the next 20 for us? What will this person feel for Leo for the next 20 for us? <laughs> wow. You go on point, huh? This person knows exactly what to do. They know exactly what to do, okay? They want to take a leap of faith, all right? They want to come towards you and I feel that this person A. The first thing I'm getting here is that distance could be an issue between you guys, okay? If not distance here, this is someone here, you know, who had a lot of self-doubt all this while because, you know, they didn't have like this direction. They lacked direction all this while of how to make this situation move forward, what to do, okay? So... 
this could still be an issue here okay because the connection still remains all right with the two of cups this person still has a lot of love for you and meanwhile they also know that you have a lot of love for them okay they know you guys are on the same page when it comes to emotional uh to the emotions okay but i feel this person wasn't assertive all this while okay uh they were more pessimistic about this relationship and they were lacking control of the situation now i feel that this person wants to take control of you know they need to take control of the situation here okay but they're lacking that uh being that um they're coming in their own way first of all okay they're coming in their own way okay and um they're still not using their will power to come towards you in short is what i'm getting here because with the seven of wands here in their feelings they still feel the need to uh block I'm getting a lot of deleting and block probably they've deleted you and blocked you. I feel I don't know why that this person is expecting you to come towards them because they are in that victim mentality right now. What's the seven of wands? See? See? So much love here. This person is emotionally unstable right now. They have trust issues first of all could have gone through a bad past or could have gone through a relationship in the past where uh, they had a lot of trust issues or someone just screwed them over because of which they're not being able to completely open up here but they definitely want to work towards this okay other people's opinions is also someone is also affecting your connection here this is someone here who cares a lot about what other people say or their opinions here but i feel here this person has a strong um, you know like that back off energy you know like a strong energy of where they constantly feel the need to protect themselves or you know like just keep that boundary you know like stand their ground like no i was right you left me you're the wrong one here i didn't mess anything up in the relationship but actually this is all just a facade here they're they're putting up a show they are actually missing you to the core okay it's just that probably consciously on social media they're probably showing you how okay they are or they're just blocking you out but that's not what it is the thing is that they're stuck on you stuck and how okay They're stuck on you. They can't move on from you. They can't think of anything but you. They're miserable right now. They're miserable right now. They just need to get that courage, you know. In their emotions, they know you're the right direction. They know they want to come towards you. But it's that ego, pride, or that just that defensive energy where you need to protect yourself. Okay, they don't want to be vulnerable. Is what I'm getting. And probably in the past also they've always been like this, you know, which is one of the reasons why you could have given up on them. Like just never agree to a fault. or you know just always you know wanting to see people like this what happens is they tend to push away because of their guards are up right their guards are always up they tend to push or block away people that are good for them which is exactly what's happening here all right what action will this person take uh, take towards leo in the next 20 for us nice what action will this person take towards leo in the next 20 for us What action will this person take towards Leo in the next twenty-four hours? Wow, nice Leo. Okay, Ace of Cups, the Sun, and the Knight of Cups. This person definitely sees you as their happily ever after. Okay, they know that you're the one they want. They want growth expansion with you. I feel somewhere, somehow, you're. I mean, with the Knight of Cups here, this person is definitely wanting to come towards you, okay? And they want to probably express their feelings to you, but I don't know why I'm getting that. They will, they will, but I don't know why I'm getting delays here. Let's see. Ah, uh, what's the ah, uh, what's the Knight of Cups? Because the Ace of Cups, if this person wants a brand new emotional cycle with you, okay? And if you haven't reached out to them, they're definitely reaching out to you. They are. It's just a. It's just a matter of time when they just get out of their head and uh, stop coming in their own way, and they unblock you and they come towards you. What's the end of cups? It looks like they are coming towards you, okay, with expression of love or apology. What's the end of cups? Yeah, this person knows that they love you, or that you love them a lot, okay, and this person wants to be on the same page with you. You know, I feel that the kind of love that you have for them, right? You've given them unconditional love all this while, and it's a little difficult for this knight kind, of knight of cups kind of energy to live up to it, because they are not someone whose love is consistent. Okay, they're knights, right? They come in and go, but um, I, like I said, with the two of cups, that's what I'm saying again. This person knows that you still care for them, you still love them. They know it. Okay, it's a given. So this person out here, it's just going to be a little hard for them to stick around because it's just showing up as a knight. Behind the scenes, the intentions—I mean, they're still unstable, right? Which is why they need some little more time to grow up. I would have liked to see the king here and the spread here, but I don't see it yet. I see them approaching you as a knight here. Yeah. 
Ya. Yeah. Uh, there are chances they will open up to you. Okay. Cups is not usually communication. They are messengers, but let's see. I feel this person may come towards you an apology, okay? Or they might come towards you with an emotional offer of some sort, okay? Whatever it is. But I don't feel you will take them back. Yeah. Uh, they're coming towards you, Leo. For sure, okay? But I think you're going to be very shut down. You're emotionally shut down to this person. You, this is, you're not making this person a priority anymore. I think you're just wanting to move forward, you're moving on or um, you just don't feel that things will work out with this person because things ended badly in the past and you're just questioning yourself, you know, like how do I have a guarantee or what is the guarantee that, uh, what are the chances of things not working out as badly as they did in the past, okay, what if it ends up like that? You have fear that things will backfire on you, so yeah, they're coming in, they're coming in but you, I don't think you're going to you're gonna accept their apology or even talk to them because I see you as blocking them out, you're flat out blocking them. Just trying to ignore them. But yeah, I think there's going to be a lot of clarity that this person is going to give you with the sun here. Yeah, this person has a lot of love for you, okay? And there's going to be a lot of clarity around here, okay? Uh, around commitment. Something to do with commitment is what I'm getting here. So probably this person will tell you why they couldn't commit to you, okay? And now that they're ready to give you commitment or whatever it is, right? They want growth expansion with you. They want forward movement with you, okay? But this person definitely has, still feels that connection with you. It is a strong soulmate connection out here, okay? I have the two of cups here twice. So it's a very strong connection here, Leo. You're not going to be able to shake it off so soon. But if you think it's over, it's not. They're coming in. Okay, it's going to be up to you whether you want to communicate with them or not. But within the next 24 hours, at least for the ones that I'm reading for, it is a general reading, guys, but they are coming in. Okay, there's going to be some expression of love from their side. Yeah, so that's what I have for you. Hope this resonates. Leave your comments below, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.